The next story is going to be like pulling off a Band-Aid, guys. We're all going to get pissed on this one, even me. So let's just get it over with, all right? There is a loophole in a North Carolina in North Carolina that prevents women from withholding consent to sex. This is unfucking believable. It's 2017, and yes, you just heard me right. In North Carolina, a woman cannot withdraw consent to sex once she grants it. If she changes her mind for any reason, it is legal in North Carolina for a man to ignore her and continue having sex with her. Something everywhere and everywhere else calls rape. In North Carolina, the woman cannot do anything about that. But legislation's being brought forth to try to change all that. Rally attorney Christopher Helsher told NBC News that, and I think this he speaks for everyone in the, on the planet, to, that to him this seems obvious, that the law needs to change. Activist Amy Guy is leading the fight against the law, and for personal reasons. She was the victim of uh, this law when her partner, piece of shit Jonathan Wayne Guy, got violent during sex. She said she refused to continue, but he refused to stop. Hilster said the guy's, the guy's husband, her, uh, attorney Hilster said the guy's husband could have gotten four to five years in prison in any other state, but in North Carolina, it couldn't be charged with rape. He ended up being charged with a misdemeanor. It was like a fine. It's some bullshit. I got to get a better clipboard, guys, but I'm going to keep going. Senator Jeff Jackson is sponsoring a bill, Senate Bill 553, that specifically pertains to vaginal intercourse and gives the power of consent back to the woman after sex is initiated. Uh, he was quoted as saying, North Carolina is the only state in the country where no does not mean no. Do you guys believe this shit? Um, you know what I'm going to say, right? We need to throw our support behind Senator Jackson and help this bill get through the Senate and, and make a lot of noise that, that this bill has to pass. It cannot be legal to rape a woman in North Carolina. We can't stand for that shit, all right? So I'm, I'm pretty sure everybody's on board, all seven, eight of us. We still have 15 people here, guys. I'm really disappointed in us. Just kidding. Kind of am, though. All right, so no matter where you live, you need to fight for this bill. You can't vote for it, but you can make noise for it. And that's what we need to do. That's our job. I'm going to make noise for it. 